the expectations are high. Um, I, I also know too that the you know the past doesn't equal the future. I know I, I know that as well. Oh boy, do I know that. Um, however, um, we're gonna we're gonna challenge these guys, and um, you know I'm not gonna be uh, you know I'm, I'm not gonna let complacency slip in to past performances. You know, I, like I say, I know those kids' expectations are high, and so we're going to keep pushing them and, and keep raising the, the standard. What helps us is what we do voluntarily. So, so over the during this off season, we all try to watch them with each other and basically just try to gain a little bit more chemistry with each other. Just hang out, do stuff around, like just fun stuff. That and that's thing that's like translating into how we play on the field. Like last year, we were we were tight, but we weren't as tight as we could have been. And I feel like this year is where we really got it. Yeah, I think our, our execution is a lot better. Where uh, we know where we're at as an offense, and and we can put more in. You know, last year we were learning; it was brand new, so we had to go a little slower. This year we're going quick, and we're able to put in more plays, more formations. So it's a big advantage for us. Yeah, it's uh, great watching our defense play and being able to practice against them. Uh, but you know, watching them play, you get excited and. Uh, you have confidence that they're going to make a stop every time they go out on the field. So no matter whether you're down or up, you know, you're always confident they're going to make a play.